This fetus had appeared relatively normal at 20 weeks. There was a little tricuspid valve regurgitation, but not much else to identify this particular lesion of massive heart seen after 37 weeks. This is Epstein's malformation, and the valve has uh, plastered down right to the apex. This is also plastered across the right ventricular outflow tract, and therefore this is an acquired pulmonary atresia. At 20 weeks, there was forward flow into the pulmonary artery and only mild regurgitation. Here we see massive regurgitation, hence the gigantic heart and the relative hypoplastic lungs. Here you can see the pulmonary valve on the bottom, aortic valve on the top. The pulmonary valve is not opening. You see the line is always has the valve closed because of the uh, closed over right ventricular outflow tract. 